Temple's field hockey team was back on the field tonight and speaking out after their game at Kent State was shut down. Alexandria Hoff joins us now to tell us why the match was interrupted. Al all right, so picture this, a college football game interrupted and nullified in double overtime because the field needed to be used to set off fireworks before a women's field hockey match. That's pretty tough to picture, right? Well, how about the reverse? On Saturday morning, Temple's field hockey team was deep into double OT in a game against the University of Maine. Those are the games we fight for and, and work for. The matchup was held on the campus of Kent State in Ohio when all of a sudden both teams were given an order to evacuate the field. So my first thought was we're in danger, you know, we need to be safe, get in a safe zone. But they weren't in imminent danger. The field was cleared to prepare for a fireworks show that would take place before Kent State's football game. It kind of sunk in on the bus ride home. Because of the sudden cancellation, the game was reduced to scrimmage status. It wouldn't count. I think that no female athlete or female in general should feel that they are lucky to do what they do or that it's an opportunity that you get to go finish your game. And to feel slighted, I, I, I felt for my team in that moment. Kent State's athletic director has since released a statement reading in part, Quote, in hindsight, a different decision should have been made to ultimately ensure the game reached its conclusion. We hold ourselves to a very high standard, and in this situation, we failed. I think it brings light to a much bigger issue in athletics. The team is hard at it again, back at practice, gearing up to face off against Bryant on Friday. It wasn't necessarily Kent versus Temple in Maine. It wasn't necessarily field hockey versus football or fireworks. This was something that we felt was deeper, and it, it was really for us, the way we, we view it, regardless of it, what have happened to a men's soccer program or not, it happened to a women's field hockey program. Now, those fireworks were sent off on an adjacent field, so it wasn't even the same one. And on Saturday, Kent State initially offered for Temple and Maine to resume their game about six hours later, but players say that was too little, too late. That game should have been finished. That's a yeah. shame. Could have been That's finished. A shame. Yeah. Okay, Alex, thank you. Sure.